रेंज इज के इज द सो इज द साइड रेंज रेंज इज द डिफरेंस डिफरेंस रेंज इज द डिफरेंस ऑफ हाईएस्ट हाईएस्ट नंबर हाईएस्ट नंबर नंबर टू लोएस्ट लोएस्ट नंबर नंबर रेंज इज द डिफरेंस ऑफ हाईएस्ट नंबर टू लोएस्ट नंबर बट द फॉर्मूला ऑफ रेंज इज बट द फॉर्मूला ऑफ रेंज इज रेंज इक्वल हाईएस्ट नंबर हाईएस्ट नंबर highest number minus lowest number number plus 1 this is the formula of rents if you find out rents of the data rents of a data then highest number minus lowest number highest just we are spelling this here highest highest number minus lowest number understand my students okay my students now class interval what is class interval i just it is this class interval look at me class interval okay my students in the side class interval the range of this move the range range of is group is group the range of is group of data of data is called is called is called class inter is called class interval the range of each group of data is called class interval look at me suppose this is a table this is a table look at me this is class interval and this is frequency number frequency number look at me suppose this is the group 5 to 10 5 to 10 this is 10 to 15 this is 15 to 20 this is 20 to 25 This is twenty five to point thirty. Look at the measurements. So this is the range of each group of data. Suppose this is a data. This is also 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 a data. So the range five to ten. You just subtract five from ten. Five from ten, and you got what? You got five. You got five, and you also got five. You also got five. You also got five. Yeah, you also got five. Yeah. So the class interval of this table is five. Understand? I got understands. Frequency after some times we just describe it. Yeah. Okay. Okay, my students. Class interval, and now we just write number of classes. Suppose you have a collection of data. You have a collection of data, but you want to find out how many number we draw. Then the formula is number of class, number of class, number of class. The range divided by the class interval. 
the range range divided divided by the class class interval class interval is the number is the number number of class number of classes yes or no this is very simple suppose therefore number of class number of classes classes equal range range divided by class interval class inter understand look at me range suppose the range is suppose the suppose the lowest range of a student is suppose 8 years and the highest sorry the highest is of a boy of a boy is 18 years and the lowest is of a boy is 2 years clear and you just divided class interval and class interval suppose this is 3 class interval suppose 3 so 18 minus 2 that is 16 divided by 3 so 16 divided by 3 that is what that is 3.33 This is yes or no? This is three. Sorry, five point three three. So you have to make at least five number class. How many number in class? Draw five number. Number of class is five. So you know when you just draw this here frequency distribution table, then you must draw number of classes five. Number of classes five. After some times we just show you. Understand my distance. Or next class we will show it. Okay. The next topics is tally marks. Everyone know tally marks. Tally marks. The numerical expression of data must belong to some classes. The numerical the new numerical information numerical information the numerical information of the data of the data of the data the numerical information of the data must must belong belong to must belong to some class some class this is very simple yes the numerical information of the data must belong to some class yes or no yes for any other value For a numerical value, for a numerical value, tally mark is put. Tally mark, tally mark is put. The for a numerical value, tally mark is put against the class. Against the class. Against the class. Class. Look at your distance. The numerical information of the data must belong to some classes. For numerical value, tally mark is put against the class. Look at me here. Yeah. Tally mark. Tally mark. Mark. Mark by. Mark by. Roman. Roman symbol. Roman. Roman symbol. Understand? Okay. Suppose we have denoted one. This is one. This is one. This is two. This is two. This is three. This is three. This is 
Understand? Okay, my students, no more to do that. 